This is one of the things that distinguished communism from Nazism, let's say, and made it even maybe more pernicious. The Nazis basically said, the world, that's for the Aryans, and the rest of you can go to hell and we'll be happy to aid in the flames, let's say. There's not a universalism associated with that. There's a definite exclusion, and it's pretty bloody obvious. On the communist front, though, and this is maybe what made it such a powerful substitute in some sense for, for Christianity, there was the notion that what we were working for was the universal brotherhood of man and this intense inclusiveness where everyone could live together peacefully. And so people were also led down the garden path by that presumption and found out that lying in the service of future utopia turns out to be a pathway to hell, just like lying in the service of an exclusionary fascist state. 